What comes to your mind when you think of a bridge? Perhaps you picture it as a mere structure that helps you cross a river or a road, but what if I told you that a bridge has the power to do much more than just meet our crossing needs? A bridge is key to unlocking economic prosperity, creating new job opportunities, and transforming the way people and goods move between two places. The impact of a bridge goes beyond just its physical structure, as it facilitates the creation of economic corridors, and helps to rebalance economic growth. Now imagine the power of not just any bridge, but a mega bridge costing a whopping $4.4 billion. This is exactly what the new bridge connecting the United States and Canada is all about. In this video, we will delve into the story of this engineering marvel and its potential to revolutionize the economic relationship between these two nations. From creating new business opportunities to enhancing trade relationships, the coming of this bridge promises to lead to great change in both countries. So join us as we embark on an exciting journey through the world of bridges and their transformative impact. The Ambassador Bridge As far as 1929, there has been existence towering marvel of engineering that has connected the two nations for almost a century. The Ambassador Bridge, a symbol of the bond between the US and Canada, has carried a staggering 25% of all merchandise trade between the two countries. For generations, it has been the gateway for people and goods to cross the border, making it the busiest international crossing in all of North America. But now a new challenger is on the horizon, the Gordie Howe Bridge. With its cutting-edge design and technology, it's poised to revolutionize the way we think about border crossings. The Ambassador Bridge has had a good run, but will it be able to hold on to its title in the face of this formidable opponent? Now, hit the subscribe button as we go deeper. The Gordie Howe International Bridge The Gordie Howe Bridge, named after Gordie Howe, a legendary hockey player whose noteworthy profession spanned over 25 years with the Detroit Red Wings and who passed away two years before the commencement of construction, has been in the works for nearly two decades. Originally called the Detroit River International Crossing, the Gordie Howe Bridge will span an impressive 2.5 kilometers with six lanes of traffic, including a main span of 853 meters. The Gordie Howe Bridge is set to be constructed on a spacious 130-acre site, which will become the largest port on the U.S.-Canadian border. The development will feature inbound border inspection facilities for both passenger and commercial vehicles, outbound inspection facilities, toll collection facilities, a maintenance facility, and ample parking. Meanwhile, the U.S. port of entry will be established on a sprawling 167-acre site and will be among the biggest border facilities across North America. This facility will have inbound border inspection facilities for both passenger and commercial vehicles, alongside outbound inspection facilities, commercial exit control booths, and plenty of parking space. The project encompasses the construction of fresh ports of entry, facilitating seamless connectivity between the American and Canadian bridge terminals. Furthermore, the project entails onward links to I-75 in southwest Detroit, thereby enhancing overall transportation efficiency. But what sets this bridge apart is its construction. The Gordie Howe Bridge is a cabled, stayed bridge, with a unique design that relies on cables to support the bridge deck, and when it's completed, it will be the longest cable stayed bridge in North America. This monumental feat of engineering will be brought to life with a unique combination of two robust building materials, steel and concrete. The steel component of the project will be predominantly used for the primary cable and tower structure, while concrete will be utilized to create the road surface and foundation for the tower. This pairing of materials is a testament to the careful planning and execution that has gone into the development of the bridge. Challenges? When the idea of building a publicly owned bridge between Windsor, Canada, and Detroit, United States was first proposed in 2004, it didn't receive a warm welcome from Manuel Moron, the owner of the Ambassador Bridge. He believed that the competition would hurt his revenue, and he fought tooth and nail to stop the project, but after years of negotiations and legal battles, the Windsor-Detroit Bridge Authority, a Canadian federal crown corporation, was established in 2012 to coordinate the construction and management of the bridge. Despite the challenges, the project persisted. 
And in April 2013, it was finally approved by the United States government, but that was just the beginning. The Canadian government, after much persuasion, allocated 25 million Canadian dollars the following month to begin land acquisition on the Detroit side, marking the start of a massive undertaking. Why it became necessary to build the bridge? According to recent research, the goods traded between the US and Canada amounted to a staggering $612 billion in 2019. And that number grew to be an impressive $664 billion in 2021. That's right, the value of trade increased by a whopping $52 billion in just two years. It's not just the economic value that's impressive, the sheer volume of vehicles crossing the border is astounding. In 2016, a jaw-dropping 18,500 vehicles traveled between the two countries each day, and predictions suggest that by 2025, that number will increase to an astonishing 26,500. With this huge volume of traffic, it's no surprise that there is a pressing need for improved transportation infrastructure. The current border crossings can be a nightmare, with long wait times and congestion. That's why the idea of building a bridge to connect the two countries became imminent. Benefits that will amount from the construction of the Gordie Howe International Bridge? The potential benefits of a bridge between the US and Canada are enormous. Not only would it ease the burden on existing crossings, but it would also facilitate even more trade between the two nations. With such a strong economic relationship, it's no wonder that these two countries are looking to forge an even closer bond. The Gordie Howe International Bridge is set to revolutionize transportation and trade between the United States and Canada. With its completion, the bridge is expected to increase capacity, improve border procedures, and provide new opportunities for both nations. First and foremost, the Gordie Howe Bridge will significantly increase the capacity for cross-border trade and travel, with a six-lane configuration and an estimated lifespan of 125 years. The bridge will be able to accommodate an estimated 2.5 million trucks and 4.8 million cars per year. This means that businesses and individuals will be able to transport goods and travel more efficiently and quickly than ever before. The increased capacity will also help to reduce wait times at the border, making it easier for people and goods to cross the border, and boosting economic growth on both sides. In addition to increasing capacity, the Gordie Howe Bridge is designed to streamline border procedures, making the crossing process faster and more efficient. The bridge will feature state-of-the-art technology and modern customs and immigration facilities, enabling travelers to complete the necessary paperwork and inspections quickly and easily. This will reduce congestion at the border and make the crossing process more predictable and consistent. By facilitating efficient trade and travel, the Gordie Howe Bridge will create new opportunities for businesses and individuals on both sides of the border. The construction of the Gordie Howe Bridge is also set to create an estimated 2,500 employment opportunities. These jobs will be created during the construction phase, as well as the ongoing maintenance and operation of the bridge. The jobs will range from construction workers and engineers to customer service representatives and security personnel. The job opportunities will provide a much-needed boost to the economies of both Detroit and Windsor, creating a ripple effect that will benefit the surrounding communities. Overall, the Gordie Howe International Bridge is poised to transform cross-border transportation and trade between the United States and Canada with its increased capacity, streamlined border procedures, and new job opportunities. The bridge promises to provide a significant boost to the economies of both nations, opening up new possibilities, and improving the quality of life for millions of people. What do you think about the Gordie Howe Project? Share your thoughts with us in the comment section below. And if you've enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss out on any of our videos. Thanks for watching.